ADL Solutions welcomes you to our video series on Microsoft Dynamics NAV 2013. In today's video, we will be discussing filtering in NAV 2013. Field filters are used to restrict display of certain records. A window can be filtered to display only certain accounts, customers, entries, or other records. Limit total filters are used to limit the contents of a field that display amounts or quantity. You can set a filter by specifying criteria for one or more fields in a table. The program then tests all records and only the records matching the criteria pass through the filter. If criteria is specified for several fields at the same time, records must match all criteria to pass through the filter. A field filter sets a filter only on a specified field. You can set multiple field filters to the same page by clicking the Add Filter icon, selecting the field and setting the filter. In the chart of accounts, placing a specific value in the box will return results that are equal to that value. To create a range, place the beginning value followed by two periods and the ending value. Either or is achieved by putting a pipe between the two values. Numbers that are less than the value are returned by putting the less than symbol in front of the value. Not equal to is achieved by putting both the less than and the greater than symbol in front of the value. Greater than is presented by using the greater than symbol in front of the value. Putting the greater than symbol and the equal symbol will present numbers greater than or equal to the value. Using the asterisk as a wildcard will substitute the symbol for an indeterminate number of unknown values. In the live ERP system, your database will have thousands of entries. Being able to filter through the data is important so that you can proceed with your work. Using the Sales Order Processor role from the Activities pane, click Sales Orders Open. Click the drop-down arrow beside the Number field in the Filter pane. Click the Sell to Customer name. Note that the field changes to the Sell to Customer name. Type the customer name in the field filter and press enter. Double click on a sales order to view its details. Press the escape key to close the details page. Click the X beside the filter to clear the filter. For more complex filtering requirements, you can choose multiple filtering criteria. In our next example, you will find items with the following characteristics, no bills of material, no adjusted costs, and a vendor number of 20,000. From the Navigations pane, click Items. Use the up and down arrow to the right of the filtering information to drop down filtering to more advanced options. In the Where field, select Production Bomb Number. In the Select a Value field, enter two single quotes, which means a blank. Click Add a Filter. Select Cost is Adjusted. In the Select a Value field, select No. Click Add a Filter. Click the drop down button and click Additional Columns to select Vendor Number. In the Enter a Value box, type in 20,000. You are now seeing records where there is no production bomb, no adjusted cost, and the vendor number is 20,000. This ends our video for today. 
BDO Solutions thanks you for joining us and please check out our website at www.bdosolutions.ca.